Good morning, good morning. Welcome to the breakfast show. This is Martin here and thank you for coming. And I do think that I was been away for a couple of days, been very, very busy with the audit process and uh, eventually we will have some good news for many of our members as well as smart Roby user. But this morning, our focus will be on Trade VSA 360 for our members and for those of you who are public first time uh, been exposed to the benefit of using the VSA 360, I welcome you to some of the ideas that we talk about. Let's get on to what we have for you this morning. Now, of course, this morning, uh, before that, uh, there is one of the public courses. This is one of the few public courses that we'll be doing. Uh, this is for the SIDC CPE 10 points. For those of you who are remisers, fund managers, uh, the 10 point is uh, uh, what we call a professional uh, qualification that you need to do. So this will be on the 8th of October over Zoom. We are doing this over Zoom for 98 ringgit for one day course. So if you need the 10 points, uh, this is definitely a good course for you. We already start registering people a low cost uh, for a 10 points, a low cost entry for 10 points. There are some other courses which actually cost more than that. All right. So let's get on to next uh, what we have for you. Uh, for the breakfast show in this session, we are noticing also the KLCI is still holding on a stage three uh, distribution, and you all know from the smart Roby, it has already turned red pentagon. Now, once it turned red pentagon, we can do two things. We can see it's going to be uh, turning down. If it's turning down, will be a markdown, will be a stage four, which we are seeing the finance sector are correcting. Now, remember, finance sector is one of the biggest uh, market uh, so-called holdings weightage in the KLCI. So if you're looking at the KLCI, which is what we are doing, that is likely to break into stage four. We haven't seen that yet, but it will be coming. The only positive is the technology sectors. The tech stocks is coming back. Uh, it has been down for like what 56 bars almost two and a half months. Whereas US the technology stock has turned green Pentagon. So that's something in here. And using the Pentagon guider with the insider buying which I'll share with you in here will definitely put you in the right spot. If you are an experience, this is definitely good. Now do join our VSA 360 and learn definitely learn more. And this is the features that we have and of course some of the things we will be doing now, VSC 360 is always looking into the insight of the company. And of course, we always do our Monday uh, breakfast show on the US market. Some of the new features as well as the insider buying screener that we have, I'll definitely share with you early on. Now on the seriousness of the news, which I've just talked about during the opening was the Busa sector. There was really a lot of negative uh, reaction to it and chip sectors and generally we know that analysts tend to look at the uh, what we call the back mirror. You know, things that have happened, they'll try to explain it. They do get it right sometimes, but there are other times they are not. So in here, they are talking about how the only negative news. And remember, a lot of the time when the news are so bad, it couldn't fall anymore. And guess what? The smart money. That's right. The smart money will be accumulated. This now they are talking a lot of the the big uh, bear well, uh, bell weather that um, haven't been doing well. But you do notice the tech sectors, which already I have said in the weeks before, we will have a correction. I've been correct many of uh, some of these times in here to form that double bottom before the market really turned upwards, and that's where we are moving up right now. All right. So you can see from here. Uh, let's look into our VSA 360. Uh, let me bring it up here. And uh, I just want to show you uh, the uh, the sectors. All right, the sectors. Go back to the dashboard here. Yeah, this is a KLCI sector. So you can see finance has been up 28 bars, but the technology, this is the one. All right, you can see technology has been down since July, which is where it hit the peak, double top, right? So right now, the market started to likely to make what we call a L-shape. Uh, L-shape is just merely a recovery moving to the stage one. Let me just switch to a three-month chart. You can see better. And that's really one of the benefits, joining a member of VSA 360. We have this exclusive chart that you could not get it elsewhere. So this market, you can see, starting to move sideways in here. Then again, it will try to retest back high as we are seeing the technology sectors are also moving up in the woods. So that's why we are seeing bad news. 
market started to move sideways and that is very very positive in here now for our VSA and boarding some of the new members in here we will check out some of the five things that we need to know this morning definitely one of the things we want to go back is the dashboard we have seen the KLCI turn red pentagon which I will also update the members to see red pentagon in here right uh, Singapore is still green this one eventually will turn uh, 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 so called uh, red soon US is red but we will see whether it will turn back to green so you notice the BUSA sector are really heavy sided to the right hand side a lot of negativity and on the market breath we are seeing number of stock that is trading below the 200 day moving average it is extremely extremely high in here all right so you can also see that uh, we have two days of uh, negative outflow so the outflows are coming up okay so the foreign funds are outflow so be warned members uh, we already had the red pentagon we already have the busa sectors uh, outflow so klci will just be correcting your chance are better off on some of the sectors like i talk about technology in here which uh, uh maybe plantation looking much better too this morning we have the rebound on the Y tier, which already been oversold, all right? So the banks is gonna be weaker. Other sectors that's already been oversold is gonna be uh, coming back. You can see YTL because of the uh, MACC case, right? Or the Bastari net, that's the one we are talking about in here. So uh, what else? Uh, uh, okay, we also wanna look at the uh, alert, alert center. So alert center, we look at some of the more popular stocks like the in the RHB Jewel or the high value liquid Kajaya, construction sector turning green Pentagon, utility, airline turning green Pentagon, BJ Corp, IJM, Yin Sun, of course, all and gas, you'll notice the breaking down of the 200 day moving average on the crude oil. I think trading below the 70 US dollar, it's definitely gonna make a lot of the energy sectors turning it uh, glo uh top glove turn back to red pentagon again uh here you can see cd so this is something that i feel that will be beneficial for those of you who is looking to have a grasp of what really happened in the market and for the longer term in here mr diy all turning red and you can see a lot more so those sectors which have already been beaten down and they are coming back in here all right so this is the uh, second so we're going to be looking at also what was the other things we want to look at our personal stock we checked the sectors already just now right so let's move on to the next sector now the klci like it or not it's uh what we are seeing that it's really moving into uh below six one six seven it will be distributing and if it does break below the 1640 which i'll show you on the next chart that it is going to going further down right there's no bull market story uh, i don't see it yet maybe we do see a bit of recovery for the u.s market now the u.s re recovery will have to come first before it comes to the malaysian market right now so we have the uh, support at 1640 you can see this level in here very important support uh if we do break down below that you can see a stage four but red pentagon is already here we're going to see more distribution markdown because the klci is heavily slanted towards the finance sector so watch out as sign-in sector do sell off next week in here so on the heavy sided uh what we call the uh let me just move back here and share with you is the year to date return for the klci all right and uh, this is where we are so looking at here So we are still at 12% in September, right? As we said before, summa rate punya very consistent since 2016. But October is a recovery month. So right, just hang on there, okay? Coming soon, coming soon. Market will recover soon. KLCI, but the technology already recovering right now. So go into those respective sectors, like in Smart Roby, you can check out the technology, find out which one is started to turn green Pentagon and NVIDIA has turned green Pentagon already. Check it out on also on the Smart Roby apps. I think it's about two, three days ago, it already turned green Pentagon. So those are the good insights we share with our members now on our stock selection successes are huh? uh, we using the advanced screen uh, spring screener because it when the market is trending correctly you do have a so last week let's look at PBA which is 5th of September I just want to share with you this so going back to the spring screener here right here we have and we want to go back to 5th right 
and we submit we want to get the minus 0 0.5 and minus 5 so if you just click a turnover and you'll notice PBA is up 3% last week after the spring which is a good thing here and this was where the spring happened let me just show you here that that was the 5th of September started to go back up uh, Tropicana had a spring it did go up to about a dollar fifty but the last three days sold back I think it will hold at this level here Aeon spring on the 5th of September this one here but it is in red pentagon see the difference this is green pentagon or blue trend zone blue trend zone that's the one you want to be in all right and uh, this one uh, coastal contract 5th of September but this one is still pretty much in the downtrend if it does break below here you need a but then again you look at the volume volume is important huh? you look at this volume in here and uh, that's why you don't want to be trading this even at uh, Chipko 96 only very, very volatile all right so this week what are we looking at uh, the 13th of September we only have one MBMR all right let's take a look at MBMR so we just switch back to the 12 okay 13 is happening right now you have a lot but we need to make sure we pick stocks that is trending up so your chances are better there's only one but this one is only 4,000 shares you don't need to look into it and it's also at red pentagon so it's definitely a no no so this one of the way you can select your stocks and make sure you want to be picking them doing the blue trend zone all right now moving on into insider buying last week uh, we had the uh, review the stock uh, cheetah global so this week let's take a look at cheetah global and also you will see cheetah global is uh, it's a food I think it's a food and uh, last week was uh, let me just make it a bit smaller than you easier to see okay and make this uh, dashboard closer smaller there and then you can get there you go all right so a uh, little bit more a little bit yeah you can see from here so last week we have uh, this one here there you go so we have the widespread down we have a bit buying but there's more buying so it's stabilized in here uh, well, some big Tan Sri thing bought here another Tan Sri has been home buying a lot more it's like buying and selling buying and selling in here so he bought a bit more he sold six million he sold six million he buy back so usually the case is they have to sell a lot they push it up high right here 186,000 in here and then sell it down so a lot of the time when a uh, big insider wanted to sell they have to push the price higher a bit right and then sell off then average it out they are still better off in here right so you do see this big push uh, there was no green pentagon and that's why following the green pentagon will avoid a lot of this uh, tailing uh, back in here all right next one we have is the uh, QL so let's take a look at QL right go to the top just type QL here and now if you look at QL insider buying it's uh, been buying a lot 1000 another Datin Chia Datin again Paduka Datin Paduka Aini Bin Idris it must be friendly party I think uh, CBL I think this is the QL uh, family but you can see from here 667 678 is also really uh, coming to a six months high and QL has been uh, a great performer I, I see this yep 18% right uh, so that's a good good recovery so if you have QL in 2016 uh, you'll be up almost to uh, above the 168% so that's a good long-term stock to be holding uh, for for QL all right also check out the ratings on the smart robe here. so this week insider buying from the 5th of September we are looking on the 11th of September a good choice in here B auto uh, Lembaga is buying M&A then we got Dufu UPA but let's look at uh, App Asia stabilize it now, again this is below 19 cents so you you don't want to be buying this but you can sort of learn and observe this uh, some buying in here uh, at around the 14 cents support insider buying then you have another one 62 cent at the education provider Sergi okay Sergi then you have the uh, buying too
So um, good review uh, for the trade VSA, able to see the inside buying, a good review in here. And uh, stock market country needs their participation of smart money. So our CV4 is ongoing from the 7th of September to 7th of March 2025. So join us uh, where you undergo the orientation to be the trader, just like on our last CV3, we have our top trader on this virtual scoreboard almost at 60 over percent. I, I think they're getting better. CV2, they were about 30 plus, and now they're able to grasp this market. I think this is something that uh, we are quite proud of, uh, able to coach our student uh, with the tools and also understanding the market that they're performing well. And that's a very good spread there in here. Okay, so congratulations. This was the CV2. All right, CV2 now at up, up to 7 of March. So we have CV3 just ended and uh, the scores are getting better. <laughs> All right, very, very good, which already happened. So we have 410% giving over 4.8 in major review in here. Give us your feedback. All right, we hope to see you more in our program or join our VSA 360. You can see the uh, CV2 is to CV3. They are improving in here over the last six months. And you can see from that now. So that's all we have for this morning. If you want me to check out any of the stocks review in here, let me know. And uh, this has been great spending my time to train our members, the VC360 members, and some of the public may be interested to join our program. That's all we have. Thank you for coming.